this the lace the it's a lace stitch but it looks like stars so I'm calling it stars lace stitch very pretty it's starts that are alternated this is very nice for a baby blanket baby oh, yarn it has baby yeah this yarn. is baby yarn and I'm using size 8 knitting needles because you do need to have at least two sizes bigger needles than what the yarn calls for so that's what it is and you're going to go through it's a four row repeat and it's a multiple of uh, four plus one so I'm going in the back of these three stitches together I am knitting those three stitches together there we go yarn over and go in there again and knit them. So that means that the pro row that you knit, knitted before needs to be kind of loose because you want to be able to go in here so you knit these three oh no, no I have to knit one so you do your three and then knit one and now you go in there and you knit your, your three stitches together do not take them off your left hand needle yarn over and go in there again and knit them and then you knit one and now we're going to go we're going to do this whole row because it's important so you knit them three together yarn over go in there knit them again and knit one and now we're going to knit our three together yarn over, knit them again through the back of the loops and now we have these two this one that belongs for that knitting knit alone and the, this is the last one so now all the uh, uh, even number rows are all purl remember to purl them nice and loose because you do need your stitches to be loose when you are going you're doing your stars so I'm knitting all this row nice and loose remember to uh, do your yarn over stitch in the middle see them that one so very loose and here we are at the end of this row and now this is the next row and remember that the, the first row that we did our stars we started with these three and we ended with these two knitted now we're going to start with two knits one and two and now we can do our three so I go in the back of the loops knit my three stitches yarn over and knit them again and then I knit my one I go again and knit my three that's one time yarn over and again of course you see that I took the three stitches knitted them and I have my three stitches back there so that's one and I go there and knit all three yarn over, knit the three, knit one and now I can end with the knit three, yarn over and knit three. Of course if you're doing a blanket or a scarf or anything like that you do need your your edge stitches you might want to do like two or three stitches for the edges of bony knit on both sides but this is the way it looks so row number four is pearl the same as row number two and this is all there is so let me finish doing this so you can see more clearly what this looks like and that's remember to that's your pearl, your, your yarn over and I'm 
using a multiple of 4 plus 1. Let me see how many stitches I have here. So that 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 17. So there it is, a multiple of 4. Isn't that pretty? Yes, Let me put is. something white underneath. Uh, I think that's it looks better when with this. So very, very nice. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much for watching. Subscribe and comment on our channel and like this video. And thank you.